All right, hello everybody. Welcome back to Pokemon Dusk. So I know I've been a little salty in my last episodes because technical difficulties keep occurring, but we're gonna have fun. We're gonna have fun, we're gonna finish the game, and uh, we're gonna have fun. Let's go ahead and talk to Dave. So what's going on there? What did the professor say? He says that he couldn't help us. And that he also doesn't know what's the cause of this infection. He just wanted to tell me something, but then the connection was cut. I think something happened there, but I don't know actually what. Damn it. That was not what I've expected. Ethan, I'm so sorry. But it seems like we still have to do some work for our survival. We can't give up now, do you hear me? We won't give up. Come to me later. Then we'll see what we are doing next. Why not just tell me now? This Team Rocket member. Did I have to kill him? What was wrong with me? I was so obsessed to kill him. He was a human. A living human. That... That was not myself. What happened? I have to sort my mind. I can't become someone I don't want to be. I shouldn't forget who I am and what's my biggest dream. I am Ethan, and I want to become a Pokemon Master. But is that even possible anymore? In a world like that? Will it be always like this for the rest of, th of the time? That text is super slow. I hope it won't. Okay, how's Quilava doing? He is low on health. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to see what this next task is. If it proves to be too difficult for me, then I'll heal up. But I want to save those unless it is absolutely necessary. Ethan, it's good that you're here. We got a serious problem. What? When I made my tour through Goldenrod City, I've seen something on Route 35 that will cause some problems. You won't believe that. But there's a huge infected Venusaur which is rushing straight into Goldenrod City. It'll be... S it will be soon on the north gate. We're doomed if we don't do anything about it. And there's no opportunity to keep it away? That mo huge monster? No. I've got a really bad conscience to ask you, but you have to kill it. A Venusaur? Are you insane? Think about that. Venusaur is a grass type. The zombies out there are all weak against fire because they're decay. And a grass type zombie shouldn't be that hard, even if it's a Venusaur. Ethan, you have to kill it so we can survive longer. And you are sure that there is no other way? Absolutely. Okay, then we'll do it. Come to me when you're ready. Well, I guess we're gonna heal up real quick because I remember this being a challenge. Not uh, that much, five more times. Come back, need my help. Heal me, heal me, Joy. Yes. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna make a quick save. Come back anytime. Now I'll try to avoid you at whatever cost possible. Okay, save, and if this I don't know. We're gonna we're gonna see how difficult this is. If I feel like I can make it through with less damage than what actually happens, then we may go back and do it. Yeah, I'm ready. Let's do this. Wonderful. Wonderful. Oh, that's a big boy. It's so huge. Brando. You don't have to fight if you don't want to. They just told us we did. Quick quilava, quick quilava. Okay. I will take some cover so you can focus on the battle. I wish you good luck. Oh, boy. The heck? Uh, was that Earthquake? Run! Okay. 
This is pretty easy. Not gonna lie. Okay. I might be a little overcautious with this, but with all good reason. It's not exactly like I can heal up anytime at a Pokemon Center. And the music just stops. Okay, I think we went through that just fine. I don't think I need to go back and redo that. Finally, it's dead. The corpse is blocking the north entrance to Goldenrod City. Might have some advantages. I agree. Okay. Any zombos around here I can kill real quick? Because I want to make sure they, they just... They're dead. I don't want any surprising me. Okay, how do I get that Pokeball? Is there even anything in there, or is that just because, you know, the, the OG game has it? Okay, I don't think there's anything else around here. That wasn't too bad. Uh, this is a new guy. He's new, too. What's y'all's story? I just walked through him. Oh, hello. You're the Pokemon trainer Ethan, right? Yep, exactly. Dave was certainly talking about me, right? Yes, he did. Our savior, like he said. He told me you were killing the walkers outside. By the way, my name is Klaus. And yes, if you wonder, it's an average German name. So, you were from Germany. No, I was born here, but my parents are from Germany. And I used to be a policeman before this disease spread out. I was in the... Police department. That's pretty, that's pretty self-explaining. I've seen that on the uniform. Yes. I was living in Goldenrod City before the infection has started. It's scary how fast things can change. I was on duty when the first infection started. As if it wasn't enough to deal with Team Rocket. Suddenly, those murders started in Goldenrod City, and no one knew why. Until the people realized that they get infected when you get bitten. Afterwards, everything crumbled, and everyone was living on their own. I've seen... So much terrible things. Walkers who ate other humans. Things no one should have seen. I think I'm talking too much. As an experienced policeman, I will do everything to help you. If I had my pistol... Well, I think I know what we're gonna find for him later. Oh, hello. Hello. You are new, right? I haven't seen you before. Yep, that's right. I'm new. If I may introduce myself, I'm Albert. And Dave brought me here. He just saved my life out there. And you were certainly Ethan, right? Dave was speaking highly of you. Even the nice lady Martha has been talking about you and your brave Pokemon. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Don't have any false modesty. You also got a Pokemon? A Vulpix. It must be very strong. It could work with us. I don't think so, Ethan. I never teach Vulpix any attack. I only let it participate on beauty competitions. But that was not introduced until Gen 3, sir. Unfortunately, it's too weak. If I had known what misery will come, I would have trained it. Oh, boy. Hmm. Ethan, before you go, there is something I got. Come to me if you find the time. Hey, boy. A thought crossed my mind. When I was fleeing from my house with Dave, I forgot something important there. I forgot my radio module at home. You got a Poke Gear, right? Yes, but it has no use. There are no survivors in the radio tower. If we manage to install the radio module, we can get more information about the infection. Maybe the military or the disease control center sends something about that disease. Maybe there is a camp for survivors, or even a vaccine? That's what I hope. It's an opportunity we should try. Excellent. I'm also thinking that... Here, you'll need this to get in. Ethan received house key from Albert. You can enter my house with this key. It's nearby to the bike shop. You can't miss it. But... I created... 
a kind of a secure system. I created the system for robbers to confuse them and keep them off my stuff. You have to know, I'm a passionate master of enigmas, but I think you are intelligent enough to solve this. Understood. I'll get you the radio module. It's a chance we should take. I need a drink. All this talking, I'll, I'll tell you. Okay, let's go ahead and go get that radio module. Okay, any zombos? Doesn't look like it. I didn't mean to burn the door, I meant to unlock it. Here we are, Albert's house. And wouldn't you know it. So that's what he meant with secure system. Seems like those rocks aren't real. I think I can move them. But you, sir, don't have strength. Okay, how do we do this? Hmm. I think I messed it up. Oops, I didn't mean to push that. Yeah, this is definitely messed up now. Or is it? No, it's not. Nope, stop. I'm not trying to push it. I'm trying to walk. He found radio module. Let's bring it back to Albert. He knows how to handle the radio module. The lava. Stop trying to... P okay, really? Just, just walk. Excuse me. I need to go up here. Okay, that wasn't so bad. You found it! Amazing! Let's see if anyone is broadcasting something about that disease. Bad news. Nothing. But, there must be some kind of military which is doing something against the infection. It doesn't seem like that. I was counting on the government, but it seems like they let us down. And now, just this. No police, no military, no disease control center, just nothing. Nothing. We're alone. I'm sorry I sent you out there, but the radio module is useless with no one, when no one is broadcasting anything. But it has an integrated music player. I don't know what to do with that. You can have it. So I'm not going to mess with that because I believe there's like some copyrighted music in there and I don't want my video to get claimed. The music player has been installed to your Poke Gear. Just open your Poke Gear and choose the music icon. I think it's a welcome change. But for now, there is only one song installed. In Golden Road City are some songs you can collect. Find them and they will be installed on your Poke Gear. Just visit some place where you have already been. Maybe you'll find some songs there. Thank you. I think music could calm me down for a while. Well, you're not going to listen there, buddy. Excuse me. So, Ethan, could you beat it? Yes, we managed to kill it. The corpse of Venusaur is now lying in front of the north gate. The body is blocking the way th through. Great. That sounds good. So, I owe you another one. It's okay, Dave. We're all safe now. Yeah, think about that. We all have to thank you for what you've done for us. It's okay. Hey, have you seen the new survivors? Some of them just came in here. It could help you with some certain things. I have, and I've talked to them and helped them. Hey, mate. The opportunities to leave this town are almost gone, hmm? But there is one thing you haven't had tried yet. Have you heard about the high-speed train of Goldenrod City? No? Doesn't matter. That thing doesn't work anymore, but our handier craftsman, Harold, could repair the train, thanks to the tools you brought him. I knew that they would become handy for us. Whatever. If we actually managed to reactivate the train, we could leave this decaying place. Why we didn't think about to use the train earlier? The underground is full of with infected. It won't be easy to pass through, but we have no other choice. A high-speed train, hmm? This could work. A safe vehicle that could bring us miles away from here. That sounds good. Ha! I knew you would like that plan. Harold has unlocked the door from the train station already. The train station is next to the radio tower. Get there. He's waiting for you. He will explain what you have to do. Clear. 
I'm gonna get another drink real quick. My throat is just really dry. Oh, much better. There's an item up there now, and I'm almost willing to bet that's a song. Wouldn't you know it. <clears throat> I'm really enjoying this so far, when I don't have problems recording it. Which seems to be every episode. Perfect timing, Ethan. If we want to use the train, we have to restore the power first. I could repair the electricity, but the thing is, there are a lot of walkers down there. But if we manage to reactivate the train, we could escape from Goldenrod City and head for Kanto. Just get straight through and go to the right. There's the underground. The electricity box should be at the end of the hallway. There are some poison Pokemon as well. They will try to attack you with some poison attacks. It won't cause an infection, but your Qualava might be poisoned afterwards. Here, take this. I hope you won't need it. Antidote. I'll wait here and come afterwards. Let's go ahead and make a safety save. Just in case things don't go my way. What's in that trash can? Is it a potion, please? Empty. Well, there goes my hopes. Bring it. Ah, uh, stop chasing me. Oh my gosh, can you die, please? Don't hit me. Ah, oh, he hit me. Okay. That's right, I'm just gonna walk on him afterwards. I don't care. You went through the fire, ma'am. Okay, anything in this? I can't check. That's great. Come here. Come here. Really? Why? Why can't I hit you until just a little after you hit me? I'm hitting the button. It's just delayed. And no, I'm not making excuses. I'm. Are you kidding me? Okay, fire seems to be unreliable. Okay, they said poison Pokemon. Rattata is not poison. Oh, come on. Oh, boy. Okay, let's speed up this Rattata real quick while they make their way back up here. Are you kidding me? Oh. Okay. It's fine. I'm still above half health. That's what matters. Really? Wait, is that Bill Sprite? I think it is. That's Bill. Okay, here's what we're gonna do, because I don't like how this is going so far. I can't save. We're going to reload my game. And we're gonna retry that. That went a little less ideal than I would have hoped for. Okay, come here, buddy. Okay. Better. Better. Come here, lady. Not you, lady. Not you. Okay, really? Really? Just... Okay. That was... I hit the button. Okay. That, oh. My gosh. You know what? That's fine. If I don't get hit anymore, then I'll, I'm fine. Otherwise, I'm probably going to reload. Are you kidding me? Arr. I love the story of this game so much, but its combat is just so janky. Come here. Let me kill you. Oh. Thank you. Hi, Bill.
Okay. Bill's dead. What do we got in here? That's a Grimer. Whoa! Hold up. Hold up. What's he spitting at me? Can I cheese it? Nope, I can't. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. I hate. No, no. Kill me. Just kill me. I'm done. No, I'm reloading. This is some crap. Here's what I'm gonna do. I have a better idea. Watch and learn, everybody. Watch and learn. I say that and I'm probably gonna die immediately. No, no. Oh my. Just kill me. Just kill me. I don't care. I don't. I don't care. We're going through. We're gonna avoid the fights because evidently I can't win. No, we're not. I lied. We're just gonna, we're gonna fight. We're gonna take our time. We're gonna be calm. We're gonna be fine. Are you... I'm not getting hurt. Not until at least the grinder. This is stupid. I love this game so much. But it's combat leaves a little bit to be desired. Don't hit me. How'd you walk through fire? Are you... Oh, I'm getting upset. You walk through fire too. Teach me your ways. I would really like to learn. Okay, next room. I don't care about you. I'm walking around. Come here, Rattata. Yeah, you go that way. I don't care. I'm going this way. Yeah, you guys can't touch me. You know what? Just for the heck of it, where did Ethan go? Uh, Ethan. Buddy, you alright? Forget it. Yeah, I hear you. Where are you at? Come here, Grimer. No. Okay, avoid. Oh, he hit me. I don't care. We're running. What? You're supposed to have knockback. Oh, I'm getting upset. I'm getting very upset. Okay. We're gonna win. Oh, we'll just walk through the gosh dang door. Thank you. Really? Just, just kill me. Just kill me. Oh. I knew coming into this game it wouldn't be easy, but this is getting a little ridiculous. Okay, hi there, buddy. I'm walking around you. Hi, girl. Oh. Okay. Die, die. How many hits does it take to get to the center of a zombie? Evidently, it's four. Okay. Calm. Collect. I'm fine. 
There's Bill. There's the girl. We made it through. Now Grimer. Okay. It's fine. He's up there now. We're gonna kill you though. You give me problems. We're gonna kill you too. Please, please be the end. I'm tired of this place. I just want to go. How long is this place? Am I at the end? No. I hear another one. I'm done with the stupid Grimers. Did that say Jack Blue was here? Who the heck is Jack Blue? Unless it's talking about, like, Gary Blue. Uh, is this the end? It's a cutscene. I can't, I can't move anything. Psst, Ethan. Hmm? How did you get here, Harold? Oh, it's you. My heart just missed a beat. Sorry. The electricity box should be at the end of the hallway. How did you get here? I didn't really kill any of them. Sounds good. Brando and I will lead you there. Just stay close to us. Okay. All right. Then let's... Oh! How could you find me? Brando, quick! Attack! Okay, that zombie is weak. It, I know it takes like four of those to kill one. Harold, what? You, you, you're bitten. He, he, he hit my upper arm. It's not like that I'm infected. I mean, maybe I'm not, right? Everything is all right, okay? Ah. Uh. It hurts. I didn't come that far to die here. Nothing happened here, all right? Everything is okay, yeah? Everything is okay. We keep doing our work. Let's check this electricity box now. Go. Oh, okay. I'm kind of with, with Ethan, like, are you okay? You don't mentally seem to be okay. There it is. Let's see what's wrong with that crap. Huh? What's wrong? It's, um, someone else was here. The train. It. This is not going to work. I mean, someone was here and destroyed the whole electricity. I don't have the electrical pieces to repair that. Ugh. So, what now? I don't know. I'm so angry right now. Nothing is working. Nothing. And my arm feels like it's burning. We're, we're done here. Nothing to do here. Let's go back to the hideout. I agree. I'm done with this place. How will the others react due to his bitten arm? Probably not that well. Go ahead. Maybe there are some other monsters left. Maybe. Cutscene. Oh, I should have saved. What? No. That's not possible. Hey, isn't that? What are you doing here? Whitney, the gym leader. I thought she fled. Tell me, what are you doing here? Hey, keep calm. We're survivors, like you. We wanted to restore the electricity to start up the train so we could flee from Goldenrod City. Yeah, but too bad. That someone damaged the electricity box. Exactly, I did that. I won't allow you to start up the train. Are you insane? The train is our only hope. He's right. What's wrong with you? Why do you have a problem with what, with problem that we want to use the train? 
You want it that way? All right. What is she up for? Your last chance to get out of here. Ethan. <laughs> She's become crazy. You know what? We should get rid of her. I mean, she won't let us escape. We're all going to die because of her. Either we will die or she. What? No. Are you insane? She's a human being. I can't. Maybe she's just scared or stressed of the situation. I don't know. We all have hard times. Okay, you really wanted that way. Mill Tank, it's your turn. Oh, crap. Mill Tank is never fun in any game around Gen 2. Mill Tank, Mill Tank. Seems like we have no choice. Brando, go. Quilava, Quilava. You can't save. Of course it has rollout. Oh boy. Oh, this is going to be a long fight. Oh, get away. I don't like you, you cow. And you just rolled through my fire. I can't even aim. Oh, stupid. This is going to be a really long fight. You walked through fire. Oh, you stupid piece of crap. Just die. I didn't save, and I don't want to go through any of that again. Yep, you can use roll after fire. Aren't you special? And no, I am not going to even attempt to scratch it. How, how'd you walk through fire? Oh my. Ooh. I can't aim. Oh, you're making me angry. Oh. oh, I swear if I beat you first try, then I'm going to do or say something. I don't know what that is yet, but I'm going to do it or say it. Okay. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I only have one potion. I'm gonna go ahead and use it. Oh, get away! Move, Ethan! Move! Oh. Oh. I don't like this fight at all. As creative as it is, I don't like it. Okay, it's down in red. What's it gonna do? Use milk drink? Oh. Okay, fast, quick like a butterfly. Oh, that was not quick like a butterfly at all. Okay, go in a circle. Fine. It's fine. Oh. Oh. Oh no! 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 Oh no! 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 Okay. Well, I hate to leave it on a bad note. But I think, I think the episode has gone on long enough. And I, for one, am frustrated. So, that being said, I hope you guys have enjoyed today's episode. Be sure to tell me what you think about it in the comments. And be sure to subscribe so you don't miss any more videos. 
That being said, I hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good night. Bye-bye.